Welcome to the Gizmo Rat App instruction video. Before we start, here's a few disclaimer. Gizmo is not responsible for any injuries incurred during the reporting of a rat sighting. There will be no data sharing, and this is not New York City 311. Best practices for reporting a rat sighting. Be careful of your surroundings. Do not endanger yourself to take the perfect shot. What is Rat App? Rat App is a test application using citizen science volunteers to gather information about the city's rodent problem. Rat App is designed to document rodent sightings while obeying all safety requirements. The term rodent covers both rats and mice. The terms rodents and rats will be used interchangeably. Rat app is uniquely designed to integrate smartphones, GPS, photos, structured questions, spoken information, language translation, maps, and AI. Rat app is not connected or a substitute for New York City 311. Data entered into Rat app will not lead to city action, but may be shown to New York City. 311 managers. If you spot a rodent and enter the information into Rat App, also call NYC 311 and report your sighting there as well. Rat App safety precautions for data gatherers. Rat App users must be 18 years of age or older. Do not go out of your way to seek out rats. Stick to your usual routes and routines. When you spot a rat, whether alive, injured, or dead, do not approach it. Keep your distance as you normally would. When safe and convenient, open Rat App and initiate a rat sighting record. If possible, capture a photo of the area in which you saw the rat. There is no reason to capture a picture of the rat. When capturing a photo, do not step out into the street where there is a danger of being hit by a vehicle. Also, be careful of passerby and sidewalk obstructions. Never approach a rat, follow a rat, confront a rat, corner a rat, or attempt to kill a rat. If bitten by a rat, wash the wound with soap and hot water, apply antiseptic, and seek medical advice about further steps. Do not attempt to capture rat data in a subway station. Do not get close to the platform edge looking for rats in the track bed. Data entries from subway stations will not be accepted into the database. Rat app user acknowledgments. By accessing rat app, users acknowledge that they have watched this instructional video. They also acknowledge they have accessed, read, and understood all instructional material related to the application. Users acknowledge that Rat App is the sole property of Basil Lab Inc. and agree they will not copy or reproduce elements of Rat App without permission from Basil Labs. Rat App user volunteers agree to hold harmless and indemnify all managers, officers, developers, employees, and members of Basil Labs and NYC Gizmo for any injury, loss of property, complaint or legal action incurred when using Rat App. Rat App has four easy questions. At the landing page, we will ask you to accept and agree to the terms of conditions after you have read through the documents. Then we ask you permission to capture your current location. Next, we ask you to tell us a little bit about the siding, whether it's in garbage can, sidewalk, storm sewer basin, park, vacant lot, etc. Next, you have the option to send us of a picture of where you spotted a rat. Remember, no need to capture the actual rat. Next, you will have an opportunity to tell us about your experience with rats in New York City by recording your thoughts, and you have 60 seconds to tell us all about it. Finally, thank you for doing your part. And this is brought to you by Gizmo and Ella the survey. Please share your feedback about the RAP app with a link at the very bottom for another survey for your feedback.
Now it is your turn. Please send us your rad sighting and help us test this platform. Here is how you can access the RAD app, the QR code and the link. No need to download anything. This is not an application, but a browser-based survey. Thank you.